Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you guys a few winter or holiday projects to try. These are more on the sensory play side or kind of like science projects in a way. This video is also a huge collaboration with five other girls here on YouTube. Today I am collabing with Breland, also known as Glitter Forever 17, Catherine Ward, Clarissa May, Hello Maffey, and Haley Williams. They are all doing some kind of holiday related video. I'm going to link all their videos down below in my description box. So head out to their videos after you finish watching this one. I hope you guys enjoy this video and if you do don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up don't forget to comment and also don't forget to subscribe for future videos thank you so much for watching and we're gonna go ahead and get straight on to the video the first project I want to show you is how to make some DIY snow well fake snow this is extremely easy to make all you need is baking soda and water so take your baking soda and just add water slowly until you get the texture that's moldable this actually feels really cold. I don't know, it's kind of weird. It feels cold and, you know, it gives it the little whole snow effect. So this is kind of a cool science project. It almost feels like a dough. And I think this will be a really fun project for kids. This next project is a snowstorm in a vase or a winterland volcano, whatever you want to call it. For this, you're going to need some baby oil and just know you're going to use all of it. You're going to pour it to the top. This is a candle jar, by the way. And at the top, you're going to put a tiny bit of water and then you're going to add some glitter to it. Your glitter is going to go to the bottom, it's going to sink, so let most of it go down. And then you're going to add some Alka-Seltzer. I also added some fine silver glitter and some blue glitter to mine. And here is my volcano or storm. It's just a fun project and it's really easy to make. This next science project was so mind-blowing. I had so much fun with this. It's a little bit messy, but it's so worth making, and I guarantee you have the ingredients right now. This is also the one I have in my thumbnail. Okay, so you need two cups of cornstarch and one cup of water. That's all you need. The rest is optional. I'm adding some red food coloring and some peppermint extract just to get, you know, in the holiday spirit. And besides, it smells amazing. Add your water slowly to the starch and just mix. It's going to be hard to mix after a while because it starts to solidify when you put pressure on it. I don't know, it's so confusing. Just stick your hands in it. It's going to be a little messy, but definitely worth it. So this is not really a liquid or a solid. It's in between. It turns into a solid when you grab it and put pressure on it, but then it turns into a liquid. It's definitely something you need to see for yourself. I could not stop playing with this. It's addicting. You need to try it for yourself. All you need is cornstarch and water. By the way, if you're going to try this, try this outside because it can get super, super messy. Oh, and also this is called Ooblick, just in case anybody's wondering. The next thing we're making is some holiday or winter slime. This is super, super easy to make. All you need is glue. I'm using some clear Elmer's glue and I'm going to add some glitter to it. I'm adding some silver and some blue glitter because I'm kind of going for the frozen effect like the movie. You're going to mix that together and then add some liquid starch or I think you could just add any kind of detergent I believe and it'll still work. You just keep adding to it, mix it around until you get the non-sticky slime. And that is it for this video. These are some fun projects to try for the holidays. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know which one was your favorite down below. Don't forget to click that like button if you enjoyed. Don't forget to comment down below. And also don't forget to subscribe for future videos. Also don't forget to go check out everybody else's videos. I'm going to link them down below like I said. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!